Technology is moving at lightning speeds. Now, I'm not just talking about any kind of technology. I'm talking about AI, artificial intelligence. Nothing in this video is real. Or this video. Not even this video. Now, think in terms of what you are doing now. And then, six months from now, that thing that you are doing is obsolete. That's how fast AI is moving right now. A year ago, this was AI text to video. And now, OpenAI Soarer has changed the game forever. This is Charles Blair, the Mad Scientist, and I want to thank you all for standing by and listening in. And we're going to blow your mind with what you can do right now with artificial intelligence in your real estate investing business or business in general. But first, here's what I need you to do. I need you to like. I need you to subscribe. I need you to hit the notification bell so you can be notified as soon as we release new videos. It would be greatly appreciated. It helps us when it comes to getting these videos in front of many eyes like yours so do that for me now open ai has changed the game when it comes to artificial intelligence large language models and so on and they've just brought out something new called sora now let me show you what sora can do the website is called openai.com forward slash sora as you can see we are here on the page that breaks down exactly how this works now let me tell you sora is game breaking it's an ai model that can create realistic imaginative scenes from text instructions now let me tell you what that means that means that you could literally give it a prompt and then it will create a video out of that prompt i'm gonna say it again type your text and based on what you type it will create a video from it all videos on this page was generated directly by sora without any modification they're teaching ai to understand and simulate physical world in motion with the goal of training models that help people solve problems that require real world interaction sora is that real world solution text to video let me show you what i mean check this first video out look at the reflection in the glasses look at the actual scene of the street with the water on it and the actual signs it looks like it's in tokyo and this was created just from that prompt that you see a stylish woman walks down a tokyo street filled with warm glowing neon animated city signage all of that is what created this video and did i mention none of this is real it's ai generated check this out Woolly mammoths. Now, what is extinct is no longer <laughs> extinct. Now, you see the snow in the background, the realism behind this, the actual movement of the fur that's on the woolly mammoth. The, I mean, it's just incredible how this technology, look at the shadows. Everything looks so realistic. This is an actual movie trailer from a movie that does not exist. The cap, the hat, the, the actual scene of the spaceship, the actual uh, imagery around it. None of this it is real. It does not exist. Check out this drone footage of a mountain cliff. Can you imagine when you're doing your videos and you just want to create some type of drone footage of an area in your city or somewhere that you want to show off in your video? And all you have to do is type an actual prompt drone view of waves crashing against the rugged cliffs along Big Sur. Look at this. Animation. This is going to cause a lot of businesses to go underwater. I'm talking about 
industries like stock footage website companies, the film industry. You, you remember they had the strike a few months ago, and this is one of the reasons someone must have had a win of this coming out sooner or later, and this is the reason why the film industry and film production was going up in arms. Now, as investors, as business owners, we will be able to use this for animation uh, in our videos. We'll be able to use it for B-roll in our videos. We'll be able to use it for drone shots in our videos. We'll be able to use this. In fact, I, I predict that sooner or later, the technology is going to take it from the point of using these animated characters or using these AI-generated characters to where you'll be able to use your own image in the video. Trust me. That's how fast I think this is moving. Now, I know what you're saying. How do I get a hold of it? Now, Sora is becoming available to only red teamers. Now, the reason why they're doing that is they want to make sure don't nobody abuse this before it comes out. So they're giving it to some filmmakers. They're giving it to some actual uh, high influencers that's in their actual company and individuals that they have on their call, what they call their red teamers. Now, once it gets run through the ringers, which means once they test everything and make sure you can't create any type of characters that could cause harm and so on, then they're going to bring it out to the general public. So my prediction, we're probably looking at probably about maybe two or three weeks from now, this is going to start being rolled out to everybody. Now, how do I think it's going to be rolled out? I think that it's going to either be added on to chat GPT-4, the premium plan where you're paying $20 a month, or it may be its own standalone product. They haven't given any type of indication which one it's going to be, but it's going to be one or the other. Now, check this one out. The prompt is historical footage of California during the gold rush. Look at the detail. None of this exists. These buildings don't exist. Look at the way the camera is moving from left to right and from going around the actual bend of the river and so on. This is just crazy. We're talking about detail. This is an actual extreme close-up of a woman, I, who does not exist. It's all AI generated, no pun intended. Now, Sora is able to generate complex scenes with multiple characters, specific types of motion, and accurate details. This just came out yesterday. So you are getting ahead of everybody else when it comes to the technology that is coming to the market. Look at how this actual Jeep is going on a dirt road and actually kicking out the dirt as if it's real. And did I mention, none of this is real. Now, to be honest with you, prior to OpenAI Sora, there were competitors out there that did okay job. You saw the actual video with Will Smith. The issue with it was it was grainy, it was choppy, it morphed into some kind of being that didn't even look like Will Smith. Now, let me be honest. There were other competitors out there prior to OpenAI Sora. I mean, you had Pick a Labs, you had Runway. Now, the issue with the competitors and their limitations, like you saw in that Will Smith video, it was shaky and it morphed into some type of crumbled up face. Stuff was just distorted. Other limitations that they had was the clips were short. I mean, those clips would only be four seconds and then you can merge another clip onto it with OpenAI you can have a total of 60 seconds. Now, they had bad realism. Look at the distortion that you saw on the Will Smith video. OpenAI, it's clear and crisp built into that actual interface. Limited camera movement. If you looked at what you saw in Sora by OpenAI, it was fluid. It was a smooth transition from left to right, panning up and down and drone shot imagery. So yes, there were competitors out there, but there is nothing out there that can do what OpenAI Sora does. So the bottom line is that this is the future of video making here today for your business.
regardless if you're a real estate investor, real estate agent, or business owner, this is where it's at. This is Charles Blair, the Mad Scientist, signing out, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.